What's up guys, Kevin here from Snowboard Pro Camp. In this video, I've got some tips for falling on your snowboard. Falling is something that's going to happen if you're learning to snowboard or if you're learning new tricks. So it's important to have a few techniques that'll help you fall in the safest possible way. So there are two common ways to fall. The first is to catch your toe edge and fall forward onto your wrist. The second is to catch your heels and fall backwards onto your tailbone. A good way to protect yourself when falling forward is to get your elbows in with your hands in a fist and fall onto your forearms. This is going to take the impact away from your wrist and spread it across your forearms and body. You can see that as I'm going down for this fall, my first reaction is to put my hands out, but I quickly bring it into my forearms. For falling backward, you want to take the impact away from just your tailbone. So as I'm going down for this fall, you can see that I'm going butt first, but I immediately get my back to the snow to spread out the impact. By going with the fall like this, I'll also avoid whipping my head back to the snow. Your snowboard can also become an obstacle when you're falling, so a good idea is to lift your board into the air, get it out of the way, so you can slide smoothly on your back. If you're falling into powder, you're likely to fall forward over your nose, and the best way to get out of this is to actually go with the fall and somersault out of it. Then you can just ride away. There will be times where you don't have control over your fall, and that's when your safety gear is going to save you. When you are out there progressing your riding, remember to progress in small steps where you have the greatest chance of succeeding with a small risk of falling. Then if you do fall, you'll have these tools to help keep you safe. So thanks for watching guys. If you found this video helpful, remember to like, share, and subscribe. Check out the beginner snowboard playlist for more beginner tips, and I'll see you in the next video.